Hi, I'm George, and I'll be showing you how to install a custom skin from Skindex onto Minecraft PE, or Personal Edition. Now this is the Android Edition, but I think the exact same technique works in Xbox and Switch and PS4 as well. The first thing we need, though, is to get a new skin. So for that, I'm just going to close this down. Here we go, I'll just back out of here, close out of Minecraft. We need to go over to Skindex and get a skin. I'll just bring up my system apps here and I'll launch Chrome. And here we go, here's the Skindex browser. I'm in the editor right now. Now if you know a skin you want to copy, you can go over here to the skin grabber and then copy that skin. So they come down here and put in the username right there. You should be able to find their skin if they have it up on Minecraft.net. Or you can go over here to top or latest and choose a skin that's been uploaded here into Skindex. Let's see what they've gotten here. We'll find something kind of fun. And we'll scroll down and see what they have available. There's some real nice things in here. That's kind of interesting. A creeper made. Fun idea. I like this one over here to us. Go ahead and we'll do this one. Click on this. It will then take us into this skin. And once it loads in, you'll see it over here on the left hand side. There we go. There's the skin. Now you need to download this. Click on download. Okay, it's been downloaded. There's my little check mark. So that's done. Okay, we can now get out of the browser window here. I'll just back out of that, you know, back out of this page here. Actually, I'll just go back to the home page. There we go. Let's go into Minecraft. I'll launch Minecraft. Now, of course, this requires that you have an internet connection to do this. I assume that you do have that running, so that shouldn't be a problem. Okay, here we go. Let's wait for our Steve to show up. There he is. That's just the default Steve. Now go into Profile, and in here, go to Edit Character right there. And over here, click on the one that has all these characters in it. Then come down to Owned, click on that, and Import. This is a skin that I made in a previous video, but I'll click on Import here. And then come down here where it says Choose New Skin. Click on that. And this goes into your folder all of your different images are stored. It's kind of hard to see sometimes, but I think that's what I want is right there. Click on that, and let's see if it has loaded in that new skin. There we go. Choose your skin type. Now this is just the width of the arms. I'll go for the right hand side over here. And there you go, there is a new skin. We just downloaded this from Skindex right here into Minecraft PE. Let's just make sure it's still here. I'll go back one step, one more step, back out of profiles, make sure it's showing up here. There it is. So this will now be showing up inside the game. Let's just take a real fast look at that. I'll click on play and launch the game. Here we go. This is just a default world that I set up. Nothing special about this. And there we go. There's that new Minecraft skin that we just downloaded from Skindex. If you like this video, hit like, click on share, check out my channel for a bunch more Minecraft videos, and I'll see you next time.